Garrett Atkins, third baseman for the Colorado Rockies, got 175 hits during the 2008 baseball season. This was about 28.64% of his at-bats. How many at-bats did he have? We'll use the five-step problem-solving process here, and the first thing we'll do is familiarize ourselves with the problem. And we're asked to find the number of at-bats, so let's let B represent that number. Let B equal the number of at-bats that he had. And now we'll translate, and let's translate this to a proportion. The second step in our process is to translate. And what are we really being asked here? We, we're asking this question. Um, 175 is 28.64% of what number? Now, when we translate this to a proportion, we can write 28.64% as one ratio, the ratio of 28.64% to 100, and this is the um, number of hits. This percent represents the number of hits, and the, the actual number of hits is 175, so we're going to put 175 in the numerator of the second ratio that we write to form the proportion, and the denominator then is going to be the total number of at-bats, which we have represented with B. So we have this proportion to solve. Now let's go ahead and do that, the third step in the process. We will solve this proportion by finding the cross products and equating them. So multiplying this way, I have 28.64 times B, and the other cross product is 100 times 175. Now I solve this by dividing by 28.64 on both sides of the equation. So I'd have 28.64 times B divided by 28.64 is equal to 100 times 175 divided by 28.64. On the left side of the equation, I'm left with 1 times b, or just b, because 28.64 over 28.64 is 1. And when I do the computation on the right-hand side of the equation and round to the nearest 1, I find that b is approximately equal to 611. Now let's check this to see if we actually have a solution. One thing that we can always do is repeat the calculations to see if we've done the arithmetic correctly. We could also round and estimate. Um, we had the proportion when we found B. Uh, we had the proportion, or the, the ratio, 175 to B. So with our value for B, this would be 175 to 611, and this is approximately equal to 150 over 600, and I rounded this way because it's easy for me to see that 150 over 600 is equal to 1 over 4, which is 25 percent, and that's approximately equal to the 28.64 percent that we were working with in the problem. So we, we have a, a feeling that this is indeed a good answer, and we can go ahead and state the result then. Garrett Atkins had about 611 at-bats.